How's it going everyone? JKXVX here, back on Forza Horizon 4 once again. Today we have another Horizon 4 custom race video. In the past I've done several different custom races using the in-game route creator. I've done a race called the Armageddon, which is a 40 mile race. I've done one called the Annihilator and so on and so on. And today we have another one and I have called it the Adrenaline. The Adrenaline race is basically a 10 mile super high speed race on the right hand side of the map. It goes from the bottom town up to the top city using the very very fast bendy twisty straight roads on the right hand side of the map up the beach and the coastline. This is a very fast race, it's one of my favourite races to do just because of the sheer adrenaline you get when you're smashing through those corners at super high speeds. It should only take about 3 minutes to do the whole 10 mile race. It's a good way to practice your racing as well because it's not one straight line. There are bends and curves in it but they're fast curves, they're fast bends, they're fast corners and it's just an all round fast race as I've kept saying. And it's a bit of a challenge so I'm going to tell you how to get this race, how you can play it and then we're going to have a quick look at the race. For some reason my creative hub is broken every time you go to it it says i don't have any events thank you for doing that forza that makes it so much easier for everyone to view my blueprints so you're going to have to find my blueprint this way you'll have to add my gamer tag it's jkxvxyt as you can see once you've got me added when you go to the game go to the starting location of the sprint race which is down here at the bottom of the map if you go to it click enter then go to solo then go to the custom events and hopefully somewhere on there on the friends and followed bit or maybe the, just the new bit you'll see one called the adrenaline by me because you've got me added i should be in the friends and followed bit if not then maybe reboot your game and it should it should pop up it, it says friends and followed so it should be there and then pick your car i would recommend using something like a koenigsegg one to one is what i enjoy using um, rear wheel drive, a Centenario might work well, some of the McLarens, the Mosler will be pretty nice as well. And just try to do this track completely without rewinding, without breaking much, and just smashing round up the coastline of the map. It really is a fun sprint race to do just because of how, how rapid you go around those corners. Now I'm going to show you a full race now. I think in this particular race I did rewind I think twice just because I messed a few corners up. Everyone's going to mess a few corners up but it really is satisfying when you get those lined perfectly on this race. So I'm going to shut up while you can see a lap of this super fast coastal adrenaline race.
So there we are, guys. There's a quick showcase of the sprint race we are talking about. So it's just a little fun race I thought I would make. I've actually been driving up the coastline quite a bit recently in-game, which is what made me think this would be a pretty good sprint race. It's basically just half of the Goliath race, to be honest. But this one only takes a few minutes to do instead of the full like eight minutes for the Goliath. So go try out this race guys, please let me know in the comment section below what your best lap time was. See what you can get, or not lap time, sprint time, whatever. See what kind of time you can get. See if anyone can get below three minutes, that would be interesting. So please guys, leave a like if you've enjoyed, subscribe if you haven't already for more Forza Horizon 4 content, and I'll see you all later.